I'm Harry. And I'm Richard. Welcome to Dead Decks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, buddy. Dead Decks. Yeah, buddy. As always, we are striving for, what are we? Striving for adequacy. Adequacy. Yeah. I'm trying this shit. See how it is. On the Mrs. Harry playmat. Mm hmm. All for Gord. All for Gord. Or uh, hockey, just for Gord. Yeah. Gord cares. Somebody else gives a shit. We're uh, we're seeing how this works, so looks better to us so far. We'll see. We are playing one on one playoff, one on one hockey challenge. Not really playing. We're just going to show you the setup, and basically how a game works. You can figure this shit out for yourself. And relatively soon, we'll have full rules up on the website, deaddex.com. Yep, Doc's almost done. Just a couple final polishes, touches to it. So, yep. So, then you can download it and print it out and do all kinds of dirty things to it. Yeah, just don't fuck, tell us about it. Go wild. We don't give a shit. No judging here. Mm -mm. Mm. All right, so let's go through the game real quick. We've already done some of the setup, but to set up a new game, uh, both players roll six die initially. That decides who's the home team. Home does not mean you go first. Home means you make the decisions on duplicate players. So if we both try to play Gretzky, the home player gets to decide whether or not he's going to let me be the only one to have him, which why the hell would he do that? But <laughs> uh, So we both roll six die, and we see who gets the most logos and pucks. Oh, I got four. I did too. Well, damn. I guess we do it again. Let's we do it again. And I got two. I got two. Three. Three. Kick my ass. All right. So you're the home team. I am the home team. Uh, so then you fill each position in your lineup with the proper spots. We've already done that. Got defensive men, left, right wing, goalie, and center. We're a little crowded on space, so we kind of did this funky. You really would pull this back and have your attack position in the middle. But we're close enough. Uh, so. And we need a puck. Oh, that is a beautiful puck. Nice. Right on top of this goal. Uh, Let's go. So we've got our positions laid out. Then you shuffle your deck and place it face down. We've already done that. Uh, draw three cards. We've already done that. Place the puck down, and we complete a face-off. Uh, the initial face-off is without doing substitutions, and we'll show you those in a second. But uh, So our centers uh, are going to be the ones to face off. We use the, uh, not the shop value on their card, but the stick, stick value. value. So I'll be rolling a five for my center. Likewise. <laughs> I got a uh, three. I did two. Damn. That's what they keep tying. In the case of a face-off, we roll again. I got okay. two. I got four. Damn. Crush me. All right. So he gets possession and he moves into the attack position. So he's on offense and I'm on defense. So now he gets to take off with his turn. So first thing you do on your turn... Well, I'm doing all the damn talking, but uh, you draw one card, bring your card total up to four. This game seems to try to seems to try to keep you at that. What the hell mm -hmm. is this? <laughs> <laughs> Cheater! Then yep. stack that shit. Uh, so now when it's your turn, you have three options of what you can do. You can substitute one to two players from your hand. So you can say, "I like these two guys better. I'm going to put them in place of somebody that's down." Um, you or you can play one card from your hand which all players have an ability, and you play them as an effect and ability and discard it, and then these things all occur. Or uh, the actions you can take on your turn, you can play any card from your hand face down and declare it as that. So on offense, you can skate, steal, or pass. No. No. No steal. Shoot. Yeah, you can't steal. You got the damn puck. <laughs> uh, and on defense, you can steal or skate. So when you're on offense, if you wanted to shoot and you don't have a shot card, you can just say, oh, this is a shot. I'm going to take a shot. So there wouldn't be any bonus modifiers, but you'd still get to do that. So those are your options. So here you go. All right. Well, I've got a shot card, so I'm going to go ahead and take a shot. Mm. Why not? All right. Offense center shot at plus one. So I will get my shot value, which in this case is a three, and I'll add one to that. So you get to roll it a four. Uh, my goalie's block is a five. We also should have mentioned the aggression factors on these cards as well. Yep, so um, all but a goalie, everybody has aggressive roles, uh, modifiers by their shot and their stick. So if you want to be aggressive, 
that means you get to roll that many additional die, but before you do that, you roll one to see if you get a whistle. If you get a whistle, then you get a penalty, and then there's a bunch of shit that takes into effect. We're not going to explain it all, but basically, uh, the penalized player gets flipped upside down. He's considered out of play, just like in hockey, right? He's so a power play. Yeah. Uh, the opposing team. And you uh, take the top six cards of your deck, and you turn them sideways, and then you don't get to take him out of the penalty box until you've drawn the last sideways card, and then he comes back into play. So that just replicates an amount of time he's spending in the penalty box. And I don't know if it's in the base set or if it's the expansion. There's some modifiers that, that fuck with penalty stuff, whether it subtracts cards or adds cards to the, yeah, to the penalty. I don't remember which one. Or I think both. that might just be expansion that starts doing shit with that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, can uh, can give other players penalties and extend the length. and Yeah. yeah. So there's some stuff out there to, to do that. So anyway... Uh, I'm not going to, for this for this case, I'm not going to roll aggression. I'm just going to roll my, my basic four. Mm. I'll stop drinking long enough to roll with you. So I rolled my five block. And I got a three. And I got a three as well. So in the case of a tie on shot, uh, I'm going to reference and make sure I'm doing that right. So tie, we do a face off. <laughs> <laughs> so that's lame, but that means everybody resets. So all players that are in attack position go back to the line. Puck goes back to the center, and we do a face-off. So since this is not the setup for the game, we have to do first to force substitution. So you draw two. Draw two cards. And these are the two that get played. Yeah, and these probably aren't well shuffled, so we might get the same position. I got two right wingers. Uh, I got a center and a goalie. So so I only have to replace one of them. I have to take my current right winger and kick him out, put the new one down, and then these guys are discarded. So I got one of the worst centers possible. So one of the things that makes the game interesting and you really have to think about deck building is, <clears throat> yeah, you want cool abilities, you want powerful abilities, but uh, you don't want scrubs because you may have to do that and put them in play. Yeah. Like that guy. Yep, my center is terrible. Yeah, for the center is the best shooters in the game, and his is awful. Yeah, I got Alexandria Dingleberry. <laughs> Alexandria so, the Dingleberry. You got to try to balance stats versus abilities and, and positions, and think about I in a real deck, I'm really not going to have all these one two centers because uh, you yeah. would not want to be constantly putting them in play every time you do a face off. Right. So we're doing another face off, and I uh, get to roll two big die. I get to roll five. <laughs> If I don't win this shit, look at that. I got zero. I did two. Oh. <laughs> All right. I got zero again. I got one. <laughs> Damn, I can barely beat you five to two. <laughs> All right. So I won the face off. I get the skull puck. I skate into position. Uh, and then I draw a card. So my turn. All right. So I'm going to do a uh, center shot rebound as my action. Uh, and rebound means, this is weird, this is one of the oddities in the rules, but um, a rebound scramble is when I try to take a shot, uh, he blocks it, and then we're fighting for possession of the puck. But when it says rebound in your ability, per the rules, you just get it back by default. So, so I'm going to get it back even if I miss. But center shot, so my center's got a four shot, I'm going to roll four die. And my goal has got a seven, so I'm going to roll seven. If I can get them all in my little tiny hands. <laughs> Let's see if I'm lucky. I'm not. Yeah. Crush me. Five. I, got like, I got one, you got a lot more. But I get the rebound. So rebound means um, I get to, the puck gets to go where I want it to. So I'm putting it right back on the center, and then it's my turn again, and I'm on offense. All right. Uh, so overlook the dog. Sorry about that. Yeah. Uh, pass right on defenseman stick. Defenseman stick shot at plus one. That's what I'm playing now. So we're going to pass over here to my defenseman. Uh, and then I get to take a shot at plus one. But and what I've done is really stupid, actually, because he's in the back row. Uh, and that's not nearly as good of a shot. What do you call that when you shoot from afar? Far away. <laughs> <laughs> What's well, a drop pass? But there's a some. Oh. I forgot what the kind of shot is. Gordon, but, tell us. Yeah. So what that means is, uh, when he gets when he rolls his die for the goalie, he gets to also roll die equal to his stick value and his block. So 
He gets some he, even more die to try to block this stupid shot I'm about to attempt. I can't get all these in my tiny hands. I'm going to do this. Two You're going to roll a nine die? Yeah. All right. I'm just rolling uh, one. <laughs> so I would never actually, hey, I got one. And you demolish me. <laughs> you got every team logo in the game. And, uh, all right. So you obviously uh, block that shot. Back to a face off. Yep. No, uh, actually, a, no, a rebound. rebound scramble. Yeah. Rebound scramble. Apologies. Yep. So you block it. And now the rebound scramble we hadn't talked about yet. Uh, so for me, how many ever players are in the attack position? That's how many die I roll. And then for him, how many ever he has is a starting position, which is called a zone, plus his goalie. So he's rolling six die, and I'm rolling one. Uh, so we're putting that with his center for now, because I think that's really where it would be. I roll one for my guy in attack. I get nothing. I get everything. You win all the rolls. All right. So now you get the rebound, and he gets to pick who he wants to have possession. Well, I don't know if I want this worthless piece of shit to have it. Uh, he, you, you may have all worthless pieces of shit. I do have all worthless pieces of shit. All right, so now you're on offense, and then you start the offense phase. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to have one to skate. I'm going to skate this fool. Attempt to skate this fool. Yep. So skate we hadn't talked about, but skate is uh, just moving into attack position. Yeah. Uh, so he has a... Stick value of two, so let's give him three. How are you? What are you doing? Oh, okay. It's yeah. like you're skating the goalie, but no, that's your goalie. I'm yeah. pay better attention. Who are you skating? This guy? Yeah. So I'm rolling this guy's stick, so he's a four. I got two. I got one. I suck at rolling tonight. All right, so I skate in position. Yep. And he's not in position, though. It's no. just weird because of our layout. Yeah. Uh... Well, that's the end of you. Yeah. All right, then I'll draw one. So, uh, you think we've about covered it? Is there any other action we want to make sure we should? No, we'll run a defensive set real quick. Uh, if you got steals, you know, you can steal and stuff like that. Yeah, I, I'm on defense now, so we can. Yeah. So, now when he's got the, uh, he has possession of the puck, obviously he's still on offense, and I start, I'm on defense. The actions are the same, except for I can, I can do the substitution thing. I can... Uh, Play a card from my hand if it's a defense ability or a skate. Or I can do a steal or a skate. So uh, to steal, you've got to be either beside the person with the puck or directly in front of. And I'm not. He's not in position and I'm not either. So I don't have anybody close enough him to attempt to steal. Uh, the only thing I can do is skate. But if I were, let's say he's in position, uh, then you're just using your stick values. So if I were here and I would say, all right, I want to play a steal. I play that face down because I don't have an actual steal in my hand. He's in position, and I'm going to roll my stick against his stick. I got a five. I got a two. Mm. So I roll two, you roll one. So then I would steal, and I get it. I stay where I'm at, and then I start my offense. Uh, skate works the same way on defense. There's so really nothing to show there. So. Yeah. That's it for steel. And there's other abilities and cool things that go on. We didn't stack them all to show them all. We're kind of showing basic gameplay. So, yeah, details can be found once the document's up in the next uh, eh, couple weeks. Yep. I think that's it. That's how she goes. Yep. All right. Well, how we do? Good enough. Yeah, buddy. <laughs>